Here for the tour, little science nerd? You filled out all the release forms, right? Our cages are made from the strongest breakable glass on the market. Why, even the chromosomes have tiny extra asses. Fascinating. Don't touch anything, okay? How about this? A mandrill, but with a rainbow of asses. Can we do that? Whoever's funding all the experiments upstairs sure is motivated. This lab is unsinkable, like the Titanic. You think we should add more security here? Please have a seat. You ever play that video game Half-Life? Okay, here we go. Here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers. Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, you Bible thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up to the second level, shall we? Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck? Would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. The problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pal? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go on, talk. Guys? Guys, it's me, the kid. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pass.
to be cats. I'm so. Okay. Any more buckles when I can We're probably all going to die here. going to a better place. Help. I'm not the only one who's damaged. Not even a citronella candle will save you now. She got right. Welcome, but I'm afraid you're still hopelessly outassed. Note the pupil dilation and increased salivary response. Those four ass cats are getting quite pissed off now. Uh-oh, here's I've released more test subjects. Let me guess, you're going to fart. I really didn't think that was going to work. Oh, shoot. Well, we'll look back at this and laugh if we live, which we won't. I feel I should mention that my test subjects have a crazed hunger for human flesh. Might have something to do with the ass adding time. Enjoy your dust. Meow. Here comes Wonder Tweak. All thumbs today. Quit sucking so hard. I serve a higher power. Welcome to hell. <laughs> now everyone feels dead inside because they are. Buzzing into action! <laughs> Nobody needed or wanted to see that. There's a dark magic inside of you. Way to loosen toes. Amazing! Your single asses beat their many asses. It just doesn't add up. My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children.
You know, not every youngster your age gets a fun. Let's try this. Well, I really didn't think that was going to work. The mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. Ugh, school's so dumb. Parents are dumb. Yeah, don't you stupid. Oh, Jesus. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Somebody's going to have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three, not it! Not it! Not, not it! Not it! Not it. Not, it. <laughs> not it! Sorry, new kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. Let's get the fuck out of here! They asked if they could, but didn't ask if they should. Yeah, and it fucking pisses me off. We believe in you! So I guess you're off to fix that tram, huh? We're waiting, dude! I knew I should have installed that app to control the CPU from my phone. What? Do it now! I can't. This is a D-Mobile dead zone. Of course it is. Sorry, I can't fast pass this out of this one. Boy, that Miss Connor is some kind of dastardly supervillain. Didn't you find a way to get out yet, new kid? I'm kind of scared. Fear not, Mosquito. No kid will find us an escape route. Uh, right, right, new kid? portal door, but to open the door, you're gonna need power. The whole point of stairs is not to need electricity! Get that generator powered up and the access to the stairs will open.
now I must depart. Access the stairs. Get down to the third level. Okay, you should be coming to my dead son now. Just keep heading west.
match. Skin a match. Hey, get that single ass forth you. Get the forthy! you not to block the boobs! You're not the boss of me! That's it! He's cleared the way! The CPU should be right through that door, kid. We'll come down and join you!
kid. Thank God. You've got to stop him. He's out of his mind. Cartman, you fucking asshole. What are you doing? Connor brought me here, human cat. The sick son of a bitch. Uh, you shut up, King. Soon this town will be rid of you and all the coon friends. We're freedom pals, fat ass. We know what you're doing, Eric. Putting cat urine into people's drugs and alcohol to make them crazy. We want to know why. Yeah, why, you sick piece of... Uh, do I really have to spell it out, King? This city is sick. We both know it. There's only one time of year when this town is the way it should be. On Christmas. So I joined the Chamber of Commerce and used them to unleash my master plan. Escalate crime in the city, blame crime on mayor, run for mayor, get tons of followers, clone new kid into genetic mutant, win election, make everyday Christmas. What do you think? Pretty sweet plan, right? Dude, quick! Take a selfie! <laughs> it's almost a shame that no one will ever know how perfectly my plan worked. Dude, you've gone too far this time. Nobody's gonna let you be mayor. Oh no, I've got all the new kids' followers. Every last one of them is now following me. Geez, that was smart. Eric, I know that Christmas every day sounds like fun, but it really wouldn't be. Fuck you, Dr. Timothy. If you guys don't mind, I've got an election to win. No, no, no. God damn it. Well, there goes the main CPU. Darn it, why did I put that thing on a mobilized trap door? Why wouldn't you? I'm afraid now someone will have to go clear to the ground level and call for the tour tram from there. All right, fine. Hurry up, new kid. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, new kid. Stop wasting time. This is okay, Mosquito. We're not going to die in here. We will survive. I want to go home. Do you think if we called it Coon and Freedom Pals, none of this would be happening? Don't second guess yourself, kid. You'll go mad. Timmy! We gotta get the hell out of here! Mitch Connor is a real dick, new kid. This would be a pretty cool place for a field trip under different circumstances like that. Oh man, I don't want a bunch of more asses! I only need one! Fuck this. Fuck everything. I don't know if you know this, new kid, but Cartman can be a total dick. So I guess you're off to fix that tram, huh? We're waiting, dude.
do this. Well, one diabetes breach coming up. I fulfilled my duty, and now I must depart. Like all the mutated animals have broken loose. Welp. like you've run into mutant sixth graders. Oh, and they look hungry. Don't get eaten. I've designed them to be removable in case anything wanted to attack people from below. Fourth, these are hammers! people in misery. This is why I don't leave the house. <laughs> Burn, ass freak. Oh, Chase, that badger looks mad and crazy. Any more buckles where that came from? One less conformist in the world. Come here, Forthy! Soundproofing the walls in here so that no one could hear screams was not cheap, let me tell you. each night. Supreme Thunder! <laughs> That's supposed to hurt, Forthy? It's the stroke of midnight somewhere. You guys are kind of scrappy. Ah. School is so stupid. Even the way they die is lame. Ah, stupid single ass dumbass. I hear the valley of the shadow of death is lovely this time of year. Woe is you. Congratulations, you're dead. I'm gonna eat your dumb forthy faces! You're the 
win beneath my mosquito wing. Good to go, and so is my bug jar. Some things are best kept bottled up. For love and justice, wonder tweak! from your mother and I. You have to get me out of here. That computer is waiting for a DNA sample from your mother. Quick, she's in the next room. Go get mommy's DNA sample and bring it here. Hurry! to me. They were about to cut off your father's head to scan his DNA. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but you have to finish the job. The only way out of here is to kill Daddy. I heard that! What the hell is wrong with you? Can I have a conversation with our child without being criticized? Oh, you're the victim again, huh? Like you don't deconstruct everything I say. Okay, Mr. Never Wrong in his life! Go, go do it, sweetie. Go cut off Daddy's head. Hurry! Waiting for an organic DNA sample. What'd she say? Did she say how nothing is her fault like usual? I knew something like this would happen, and it's why I've told your mother to keep her fucking mouth shut! I told you if our child's powers were discovered, they'd try to harvest our DNA and make a genetic clone! You did fucking not! Listen, kiddo. The CPU is waiting for either of our DNA. Just trick your mom into walking over to it. Don't make our child choose sides! That's so unfair! I'm trapped inside of a tube thingy! My legs are broken and my arm is almost ripped off! I could bleed to death if I move! You hear that? Go get mommy's arm. That should do it. Right on the table, sweetie. Uh, oh! If you take my arm, it will kill me! Please, don't kill Mommy, sweetheart. Mommy loves you. 
okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Is this... Is this about the medicine I put in your food? We only did it to protect you. Your dad knew it had side effects. Go ask him. Go ask your dad about the side effects. See, that wasn't so hard, was it? What took you so long, new kid? You're just screwing around having fun? All right, Freedom Pals. We've got to get out to the town and tell everyone what Cartman is doing. I don't think so, guys. You came all this way just to die, Coon and Friends. Freedom Pals. Coon and Friends. Freedom Pals. Coon and Friends, Coon and Friends, Coon and Friends. Careful, guys. He's got some kind of super weapon. It's over, fat ass. We're going to tell everyone on you. Yeah, you hear that, Connor? You sick son of a bitch. <laughs> you shut up, King. We need each other. Don't you get it? I create the crime and you stomp it out. I am good for your franchise. Oh, fuck, I get it now. But then the new kid had to come along and try to stop me for good. I had no choice but to have my own new kid built. What have you done, Eric? Simple. How do you stop a coon friend? By creating a massive, genetically altered coon friend from that hero's DNA. What? Oh, dude, that's so fucking base. What, what do you mean, King? Really? You're just gonna fight a superhero by creating a big genetic mutant from the hero's DNA? That's like every douchebag superhero movie ever. Yeah, because it's key. It's not key. No, no, it's cool because it's like the ultimate enemy. Oh, give me a break. Well, anyways, I wasn't able to finish getting the new kid's DNA, so I had to resort to cloning a different superhero. Which superhero? Sorry, Kyle, but I'm 
filled with mutant rage and I have to destroy you guys. Wait, wait, hold everything. Is there a problem, Doctor? Ooh, okay. I just wish to observe a genetically augmented superhero squashing his tiny foes into a viscous red paste. Pretend I'm not here. Here we go. Oh, okay, no, no, watch the eyes, please. These glasses are prescription and they're really expensive to replace. Careful now. I kind of feel bad for him. It's a scritch, but I have allergies, and so it itches. As an expert on pain, that looked painful. Oh, could someone please climb my folds and staunch this blood flow? Prepare to be swarmed. Why would you do such a horrible thing? Let me guess, you're going to fart. New kid, you might want to do that fart that rotates the Earth 180 degrees now. If I go back home with a sunburn, I won't hear the end of it from my mother. Fascinating, and you broke my fan. Ready for this, dorks. Maybe you shouldn't be so flammable. Okay, I'm good now. I'm gonna kill all you again, okay? I'd love to show that trick to my mom sometime, that bitch. Meow! Oh, some man. 
be fine. There's a dark magic inside of you. You're a kid after my own black heart. Try it now, new kid. Use your phenomenal fat as to make it night again. I've almost got it all, but I need to be fair. Who wants to see some beautiful boy's ultimate action? Now would probably be a good time to attack, kid. The weather sucks as usual. Spread the itch. Suck all the hope from the world. Let's go, posers. And that's what it's like not to have a soul anymore. Okay, that's got it. Game on. Smell that? Burning flesh. Laser attack! Ah, this isn't fun anymore! Not even a citronella candle will save you now! Nine and ten! Oh great, another old negative! Never get close to anyone. I feel like something tragic is about to happen. Happy life sucking. Oh, remind me to rip your beating heart out of your chest for that. Okay, okay, I think I'm ready. in a frigid embrace.
regretting not getting the spray, but I just can't trust it. Spin aside, wonder tweak. This time I thought more asses were better than one, but it's what's inside the ass that counts. Oh, oh, I think I got a pulled muscle. I don't think I should play anymore. It, it. Nuki, are you okay? That last thought might have killed him. That was pretty amazing, dude. I've never heard anyone rip one like that. Well, I hope you've all enjoyed the tour. Maybe now you have a new appreciation for what genetic engineering has to offer. You're now all free to exit right through the gift shop. Gift shop? Feel free to look around before enjoying the rest of your day. Perhaps you'd like to buy a I Survived Genetic Mutants t-shirt or purchase a photo of you enjoying the tour. Lots of great things to remember your visit. Let's get the fuck out of here. That was bullshit. All right, we gotta go tell on Cartman. Uh, who do we tell? I don't know, what time is it? It's, oh shit, oh no! What is it, Mysterion? Dude, the new kid farted so big, he made it next week. What? Check your phones, it's 10 days later. Oh great, the new kid farted us to next week. Damn it, he screwed us! Way to go, new kid. Cartman's being sworn in as mayor today, and it's all the new kid's fault. Come on, Freedom Pals, we have to stop him. Freedom Pals, this is Mysterion. I'm at the mayor's office now. You have to come see this. He's 